A Perth dad who stabbed his son to death then went to watch the AFL Grand Final has been found guilty of murder. Matthew Fisher-Turner was killed after an argument over the family car. His body buried in the backyard of his Parmelia home. Ernest Fisher attacked his son from behind with two kitchen knives, stabbed him up to six times, then left his children to bury the body so he could watch the AFL Grand Final. He told police killing the 23-year-old was the right thing to do. He claimed he acted to protect his family because Matthew Fisher-Turner was abusive and violent. But a Supreme Court jury took just hours to find the 67-year-old guilty of murder. Matthew's siblings, Joshua and Hannah Fisher-Turner, also found guilty of trying to cover up the crime. The biggest nightmare of anybody would be to be killed by your own loving family, the people you think are going to be there for you. Matthew's body was discovered buried in the backyard of his Parmelia home after friends reported him missing in 2016. His murder was pre-planned, Ernest Fisher fetching his weapons from a shed and describing how he had to get the jump on his son and stab him hard to make it count. Joshua later admitting to cutting up the blood-stained carpet and bleaching the crime scene. Matthew would be really happy right now up there thanking with his mum, him and his mum will be stoked to see that he's he's in a good place, a better place than where he was with his dad. While Joshua and Hannah Fisher-Turner were visibly upset throughout the trial, today none of the trio showed any emotion as their guilty verdicts were handed down. They'll be sentenced in August. Hopefully, Maddie, you can now rest in peace. Caitlin Barr, Nine News.